Green Man Gaming. They're the Green Man people. They came from outer space to give us great deals on video games, which is not the stupidest thing I, that aliens have been depicted doing, by the way. It was Crossing Guard Lady. Hello, audience! A dare here. We got a message here. Isocorp stopped giving us the silent treatment. But it's clear from their message, they're not going to answer our questions. Isocorp uh, stopped giving us the silent treatment, but it's clear from their message they're not going to answer our questions. They propose a deal. We fix one of their malfunctioning rovers, and they provide a generous, as they put it, funding injection. Their legal team has also warned that any mission should be strictly for repairs and further inspection of the vehicle will be taken as an illegal act. Okay, you're being super fucking suspicious about it. In other words, if we wish, we could send drones to fix their rover, but nothing that can evaluate its purpose like a rover. And we will be paid for the effort. Okay. Not suspicious at all. Let's wait and, uh, frickin' let it die. Let all of them die. Let, let them, let them all break down. That's the new plan. Let them all break down. Invention, they'll, they'll all break down like the Opportunity Rover. I miss the Opportunity Rover! <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh. Okay. Look, I don't have a freaking uh, commander available to help you bastards right now, so I'm gonna focus on colonization. Launch the rocket. Is anyone even living in this dome? No. <laughs> no. Passenger rockets. Uh, filter. No, we still don't want tourists. <laughs> uh, let's get the cowards. And the uh, whiners. All right, cool. That'll give us 22. Uh, swap out these no specs for a few botanists. Launch. Now we can get the farms up and running. Like, for real this time. And while well, they're looking at that, uh, I have another idea. How are we fixed for money? We're good. Wow, we're good. Like, oh, holy shit. <laughs> wow, you could fit an entire machine parts factory in that thing. <laughs> uh, send me a fuel refinery and a moisture evaporator, please. All right, the next thing we're gonna need to worry about, actually, we need to worry about this, is the production of machine parts. To that end, two machine part factories. Let's see. Let's not repair that one vehicle because I believe we're about to trigger a fl uh, about to trigger a flag. Let's not trigger said flag. All right, where are the ships? They are 83 and 92 percent of the way here good good and that uh, cargo pod that'll be there no oh, wait no the rockets arrived first blah 
All right, land all three of the things at once. Land all three. Land all three. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Landing all three. <laughs> and then the rocket landed itself. Oh crap, right, we have the Earth sick guy. New colonists have arrived. Colonists are departing. You get back here. We still need you. Damn it. All right, 22 colonists are not arriving. Like 44 are arriving. That's going to wreak havoc on our water needs. We can support nine more waters. Please put a evaporator like right there. Dude, it's a prefab. Just build it. Come on. Guys, it's a prefab. Build it. There you go. And upgrade. All right. 0.7 and 0.8. This is good. This will help us immensely. Thank God. Welcome to Mars. Yes, hello. Please find your uh, local residences. Plenty of food. Research complete. I think. Drone printing. Nice. Wait, what's this? Fueled extractors at white. The arcology provides comfortable living space for many, many colonists. No longer will we have to build the water reclamation system, but we probably still will. Consumption is 4.8 water, and with the thing, that's 1.4. Church of the New Ark is offering a ton of stuff. Wow. <sighs> okay, Church of the New Ark just... And Church of the New Ark just showed up. Hello. How are they doing? How are... How is everyone doing, actually? 50 people, 204 buildings. Japan, 48 people, 219 buildings. Colony of the... Colony of the Blue Sun Corporation, 236 building. They are swimming in concrete. More concrete than us, actually. Channel to choose if you don't want the blues. Japan still has a ton of metal. How? <laughs> Blue Sun Corp is also fixed pretty well for power, which is weird. And church, and church of the New Ark is doing pretty much nothing in terms of research. Huh. Our standing with the Blue Sun Corporation, however, is currently very nice. Thought there was a cold wave coming in. Hmm. <laughs> Another colony has tried to steal our scientists. Uh, Dear Dr. Oddlove, says an email, redirected to you by a loyal scientist. We have built this amazing research facility for, of the future. The only thing it needs is the expertise of a renowned academic like you. We cordially invite you to join us and agents from the colony of the Church of the New Ark. I knew it! <laughs> agents from the colony of the Church of the New Ark have contacted some of our leading scientists with offers to join them or at least sell out our research secrets. All right, there's a contractual penalty for failure to fulfill obligations. See the small print on the contract. They can't leave. Okay, but they must send back secret reports of their work. Mutually assured deception. Hmm. I 
kind of like having spies. And we'd only lose half of our scientists. Well, then again, we did just bring in a whole lot more. All right, tell them to send back secret reports. How many did we look? <laughs> wow! <laughs> We're gonna need more work shifts on this thing. In fact, let's have it working around the clock. High priority. Okay, that'll do. Thank God. People in this dome will also be able to work, work on it. Very helpful. Right, so, how many scientists did we lose? I need numbers, please. We do have the university. We can trade more. We only need three scientists. We mainly need engineers. Main, it, it's main, it's mostly engineers. How are we fixed for food? Consumption is 26, but production is 5. Are you guys not growing these crops properly? What's going on? Don't you people know- Don't you people know how to grow crops? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Alright, let me think. Uh, 15, 14, yes. Yes, we can definitely afford to grow soybeans. So after the week, switch over to soybeans. That'll, uh, bump up the soil quality slowly over time. Soybeans also produce a lot more food. We're we're basically living on soybeans right now. It's got to be better Sector than what the, It's got to be better than what's going on over here. These guys suck every year. We need to do something about it. So Time for, uh... Mm. We're really stretching our water capacity here. I think what we need right now... Is... Okay. Let's just buy some insurance real quick. Insurance. Oh, uh, and scrap that. Are there any rockets ready to leave besides this one? Uh, excuse me, this is a high priority building. Please fill it up. Okay, the simple fact remains there are not enough people in this dome. Still. Resources are low. Oh good, thanks for telling me. <laughs> Ten I'll tell Earth to send some apples or something. Alright, now two of them are broken. Two of their dumb little rovers are broken. Meanwhile, I'm sending out a rover of my own. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Apparently I'm not. Because that's right near their stupid cars. I could just... Hey! Son of a bit With this many cars, we... With this many cars on Mars, we have to establish a speed limit now. I can't believe this. 
That was one of the be that was one of the benefits of living on Mars. We didn't have to worry about a goddamn speed limit. <sighs> you guys still doing algae? I need you to swap that out. Swap it out for more leaf crops. There you go. Also, figure out why no one's working there. That, that's important. I should have told you to do that first. Probably because everyone's gone to work in the factories. The trade off there is that we have a ton of other materials. Yeah, I'll take your metal. Thanks, Japan. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff not working. We really need more people up here. Uh, let me think. Um, we could send forth another rocket. Right now, I, I right now, now we have a fuel problem, so things aren't great. Set up that second uh, fuel refinery, please. There we go. That'll basically double our fuel capacity. Sector scanned. Mm. So what exactly is wrong with the car? If you don't tell me, I can't fix it. it... Oh. I see how it is. Complete. Nuclear, huh? I see what's going on here. It's a bomb! <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Anyway, we got battery optimization now. Water, oxygen, power, and, s and power storage capacity increase. Yes. We really need to get our research crap together. Oh, what's our population? 164. If we could get that to 100 in the next 30 days, we would actually accomplish the goal of the original game. Vacant residential slots 35. That rocket's leaving. <laughs> Are we still trading our concrete? Like Job, I think we are. Okay. I got a, I got I got an idea. That is we are at 39 electronics. It's time to start getting our infrastructure together. Shuttles. It is time for the first shuttle hub. Let's see if we can tuck it in. Yeah, we can. Tuck it in right there. Good on polymer, and that's only 10 electronics, too, so. Make this a high priority, too. 
Very nice, almost done. Let's just get the infrastructure put together. Ah, that's it. And now it just needs a bit of fuel. Fuel, please. Uh, fuel, please. Don't tell me the fuel's only going to the... the damn rockets. Watch this. Yeah, it's good. I suppose it's time for us to get this one out of here. I was kind of keeping this one on standby in case something came up, but sure. I'm not entirely. T oh my God! It is. It is still there. Okay, so Japan just researched crowdfunding. So did the Blue Sun Corporation. Hmm. Honestly, we're doing pretty all right with money. What can we do with some covert ops stuff? <laughs> Steal tech, recruit colonists, sabotage buildings. Hmm. Jesus Christ. We could straight go to war. Our red shirts. <laughs> Soon will be the time for us to betray the crap out of these people. <laughs> then we'll go in, start recruiting people, be like, Hey, come to our colony. Ours isn't falling apart. Oh dear God, no. Oh no! Well, at least the shuttles are online. Let's construct three more, please. Oh my god, they're all... Oh god! Okay, well, the worst thing that could possibly happen has happened. The concrete has stopped flowing. Which means we have to go get more. Wait, hang on. People who aim for perfection learn soon enough that it's a moving target. Guess Isocorp didn't aim high enough. Isocorp is, ob is having obvious issues with the mysterious rovers as they seem to be malfunctioning one after the other. Instead of admitting the faults in their predi predictions about the rough Martian conditions, the Isocorp team has sent us a message which, quote, gives us gives the Martian colony command the rare privilege of sending one of our more analytical vehicles to look into the to the most certainly small miscalculation that caused these temporary annoyances end quote furthermore they go on to remind us that by choosing to analyze their broken vehicles we are, we have an understanding not to dig beyond any obvious logistical shortcomings in their design and agree to full and utter discretion anomaly found okay resources are low sector scanned are we out of food again? oh my god we are how are we having this much trouble with food We're trying to get the frickin' soil quality up here. It is, Funny it is a hassle. Received. Hey, money. <laughs> All right, which one has the thing? That one. Okay, so just don't touch it until we're ready. We'll focus on other things for now.
Right now we have a bigger problem. Our excavators are done. <sighs> oh boy. Alright, let's see. Supply pod. An RC commander. Excellent. I have a plan. I have a plan to fix all of our concrete problems once and for all. We have six Welcome shuttles back. on standby. And you are listening We're gonna to need all of them. I guess you all know I'm a huge baseball fan. Do you know how long baseball This has current been stockpile the isn't of game, concrete isn't gonna last. Concrete is our one bargaining chip. We lose that, Some we lose Mars. And I refuse to lose Mars. I have my own vision for how I want century. Mars to look. In it, there are illustrations of priests hitting balls with a stick. Oh, they how's this right. going? Others say oh, fantastic! For the theory that baseball We're gonna have tons of water. Of stool ball. Maybe they are right. I think it is important to point oh, out that both hello. and <laughs> have extensive Can I help you? No? Okay. Go away. <laughs> anyway. Well, in the end, I don't really care. Alright, here's I my plan. It's a good plan. Next you guys are gonna like it. Next track. We're gonna drop the supply pod right here with the com with the drone commander. And then we're going to get a Universal Depot right here. Plug that in. Next up, power. Wait for the materials to arrive. We need more than four drones out here. Let's see if we can get a few new, a few more prefabs. Eight. How about this hub? Is it? It isn't doing too much. There we go. What the? Hi. Please go away. Right, eight out of eight drones. We need to spend concrete to make concrete. And that's what we're gonna do. By placing a concrete extractor here and here. Boom. There's probably more power than they need, but whatever. Hey, don't put food here. That's an order. And don't put rare metal. Bring me only what we need. So no polymer, no electronics, no fuel. Bring me only what this facility needs to operate. Sector scan. Anomaly found. Nice. Go get it. Oh. Goodbye! <laughs> Maybe we'll have a truck establish a uh, frickin' trade route. Oh, we, we have tunnels, don't we? We should have built one. Either way, we'll send a truck over right now. Oh, how we fixed for metal? Could be better. Could be much better, actually. Did the mine ever run out? No, not yet. It's about halfway done. Very high grade, though. It'll last a little bit longer. Hi there. Please leave. 
Please leave my colony alone. <laughs> it's talking back to me now. <laughs> Go ahead and unload your metal over there. I'm gonna go back over here, establish a concrete depot. This is now our main concrete deposit. Breakthrough discovered. Hmm? Martian-born ingenuity. Martian-born gained 10 performance. Okay. That might be useful. Hmm. We need these we need these crop yields. So get that. Then work on the arcology, obviously. That's the right thing to do. Cut down on our maintenance costs. And then... Work on getting our own machine parts factories. In the meantime, I have another idea. Production. Eight. Yeah, go ahead and build it. Yes. Yes. Exactly as I intended. There are Earthsick colonists. They can suffer. <laughs> what do they want? Dining and shopping. Are you fucking kidding me? First of all, there's the three grocery stores. They provide shopping. There's three grocery stores. Wait, no, the Yes, there's three grocery stores. Resources are low. Uh, I'll call in a shipment. Heavy load on the drones. See if I care. Ooh. <laughs> How much for one of these? Five. One for a drone. Okay, turn this building off. <laughs> this building isn't operating right now. We don't have the electronics capacity to accommodate that. Not yet, at least. We're trying to get caught back up in polymer. And fuel. Speaking of fuel, uh, let's build another refinery. That one's kind of close to the landing pad. Ooh, that is a lot. Get it out of here. What are we gonna do when the goddamn mine runs out? Hopefully we have the space elevator by then. We haven't had a huge emphasis on research yet. Drop it off here. You know, you can offload that polymer instead of hogging it to yourself. Frankly, I don't see what the point of that is. Eh. Uh. Sector scan. 18 hour warning due to one sensor tower. So you're penalizing me now? Because I only have one? Fine, I'll build a second one. Way over here. Yeah, you just use that one, uh, 
freaking thing there. How many rovers are still operating? Two. Okay. Just scoop that crap out of the ground. Oh yes, we're back with the concrete. I think I'm gonna leave it off here. Uh, that is uh, more surviving. Mo hmm? Oh, sweet. That is more surviving Mars, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Things are starting to get kind of screwy with our friends over at ESOCorp, aren't they? Hmm. Thanks for watching, guys! And I will see you in the next video. Well, I thought I built a pipe. Apparently I didn't. There we go. Now it's plugged in. Thank God. Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain Why don't you sing along, my friend, for it's our last refrain Forever young, ever strong, ever brave